Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we're gonna show you guys how to back up your Microsoft Outlook data, as well as how to migrate the data into your new computer or new version of Office or whatever the case may be. Now, before we get started with that, if you're interested in your own copy of Office or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so I'm gonna head into Outlook and it's a fairly simple process to actually save a backup file of this data. So if we go to the file tab, we're gonna go over to open and export. Next step is to click the import slash export tab. And then here we have some options. The one we're gonna to wanna to use in this case is export to a file. So we'll select that and we'll click next. Next we'll choose Outlook data file, PST is what it's called and we'll press next again. And then here you have some options on what different folders and whatnot you wanna save. I'm just gonna leave this as default and we're gonna carry everything over. So I'll press next again. Here I'm gonna put allow duplicate items to be created. And in the actual name of the .pst, I'm just gonna title this indigo outlook.pst. And then we can browse and save this wherever we want. So go ahead and just put it on the desktop and we'll press okay. Next, we'll press finish. And now we have the option to sort of encrypt this with a password. I would only do this if you're staying on the same computer. If you're moving computers or you're creating this backup for let's say a USB drive or something like that, leave the password blank because otherwise it won't even let you move the file. I'll go ahead and leave it blank, but if you want that protection, you can fill out the password. All right, next up, we're gonna show you guys how to actually open this data and get this data back into your new Outlook version. So we're gonna go to open Outlook data file back in the file tab of Outlook. We'll go over to the desktop where I initially saved that PST document, Indigo Outlook, and we'll press OK. And now at this point, you'll be good to go. You'll have imported that PST, and you can see how it's showing up here as Outlook data file. And that's signaling to us that the PST has successfully been imported to Outlook. All right, guys, so that's gonna do it for today's video. If you have any questions, drop those in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Again, if you're interested in your own copy of Office or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have links in the description box below. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video.